three reasons why you should be using compression in a mix. One, to make a sound more consistent and easier to hear. If a sound has a dynamic range that's too wide, meaning at times it's too loud and then other times it's too quiet, this can make it difficult to balance with other elements in your track. Compression can help even out the level of a sound, reducing the difference between these moments and ultimately making it easier to sit within a dense mix. Two, to control and shape the sound of an instrument. Compression can manipulate a sound's attack and sustain. For example, by using a fast attack time with makeup gain on a guitar, we can reduce the impact of its plucks and increase the presence of the chord ringing out afterward, making it feel more sustained. And three, to add character to a sound. Using certain compressors can add a distinctive style and sound to your music. Many engineers like to use specific character compressors to add energy and excitement to a track, like the 1176, which adds a grittier compression sound. Learn more by watching my compression playlist on YouTube, and that's 